one fraction. We have a 2007 Buick LaCrosse. And I'm uh, going to do a quick walk around just to show the overall condition of the vehicle. But uh, as you can see, it's a pretty nice looking car. Uh, generally pretty shiny paint. There is, looks like just a little clear coat peel right on that top of the uh, fender. Uh, but that's about it. So we're going to jump in and show you uh, everything here. But this was donated to the Paralyzed Veterans of America. It will be auctioned to the highest bidder. So looking at the top here, you can see the paint is all nice and shiny on the top. Uh, looking at the windshield, I don't see any, any chips or cracks or anything there. Uh, it does have 118,000 miles on it. And uh, looking at the hood, I don't see any, any issue there at all. It's very shiny and nice paint on the hood. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and look at the bumper here. So the bumper, there's just like a little chip right there. But... Uh, a shadow off there but in general um, very nice paint this is right here there is just a little bit of a clear coat fade on the top of that uh, fender but so far that's the only uh, thing I've seen otherwise the paint looks really great on this car so it's nice and shiny Going over the top column you can see the windows got a nice tint to them and uh, the tires here the uh, tread's not great cracking though so that's what the front tire looks like the back tire looks like yeah it does it the back tire has more tread on it and I don't see any crack in there either so in general pretty nice looking car the paint across the trunk looks good there's the lacrosse CXS and uh, looking at the bumper here there's just a little bit of a uh, uh, scuffs, whatever you want to call those, right there on the bumper. Uh, going around the side here, right here is just a little bit of a uh, clear coat bubbling. But all the way down the side, this this fender does doesn't have the uh, uh, the clear coat peeling like the other side did. Across the column, all looks great as well. And uh, looking at the back tire, the back tire seems to be in good shape. I don't see any, any cracking or anything. There is like a little scrape right there. Across the bottom, it all looks pretty good. This tire doesn't have much tread on it at all either. So it looks like the back tires were replaced uh, more recently than the fronts were. But we're gonna go ahead and jump inside. Take a look at the interior here. Uh, as you can see, the interior looks pretty good. Looks great. I don't see any cuts or anything in the seat. It does have it does have a little bit of a smoke smell in here, so uh, it's not horrible. But there, it's whoever had this car probably was a smoker. Um, looking at it, it has passed smog, so you got a fresh smog certificate. It's ready to just be picked up and registered. The console looks good. It looks like all original equipment on the dash there. And uh, the passenger seat looks good. The interior in general looks looks really nice on this thing. I'm not, I'm not gonna pull this all the way up, but it looks like uh, I don't see anything. It's got a lot of stuff holding it down. So it's got a dash cover. Uh, I'm not totally sure what's under there, but I didn't see any cracks just from the part that I pulled up. Open the back here. So as you can see, the back door looks good as well. Looking at the interior, everything seems to be in in good shape there as well. Uh, the back uh, the back door looks good. The panel on the passenger side. And looking up at the top, it all looks very clean. I don't see anything coming down. So the headliner all looks to be in really great shape as well. So I'm going to go ahead and start it up so you can hear it run. As you hear it starts right up.
It's got a 3.6 liter V6. nice so so this has a fresh smog certificate runs and drives good ready to be picked up uh, by the winner so bid with confidence on motorbucks.com or download the app for android or itunes good luck everyone